Okay, this is take 562. Well, 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 what do we have here? Could this be what I think it is? I think it is. Well, whatever it is, it's nicely packaged. Got something. Another thing. And there's more. It's very hard to do this when you've only got one hand free. And finally, um, yeah. Mm. Well, here we are. So, this, all of this is what was in one of the bags. I've no idea what this is. Some kind of mount, I think. A couple of battery chargers, a remote control. A couple of spare batteries, I think. Well, let's see what's in this bag. I know what's in there. Here we are. Don't think my tablet's getting very good focus on this, but yeah. Let's see what's under this little. Yeah. Okay. Very nice. I haven't seen what's in this little bag yet, so let's just tip the contents out. Ah, oh, no way! Is this a GoPro? Oh, that is awesome! Thanks. Well, um, yeah, let's take these for a test drive. Now, I'm not sure about the charger, if this will run off UK voltage, so I am going to run that off a transformer. Yeah. Okay, so I've had a closer look at the chargers. Didn't realise I've actually got three. This one I'm not so sure if I can run it on UK voltage, but like I said, I'm going to run that off a transformer. These two, however, do seem to be universal voltage. You might be able to see... If I can get that in focus, if I can... Yeah, there we go, see? 100 to 240 volts on that one. This one is also... Focus... 100 to 240 100 to 240 volts The candy hand as you it's dibbly bill would say charger. Yeah To be safe. I'm gonna run that one off a transformer I've already put a battery in the camera Let's See if I can open this up Very hard to do this one-handed and turn it on. Let's see if this battery's got any power. I know the GoPro is low because I've already tested that. So that will be charged when I can figure out how to do so. Oh, this is exciting. And it can's booting up. It's got a fair bit of weight to it too. And it looks like this battery is pretty well charged, so... Something okay. I'm gonna try this on the other battery. Oh, what's just something's just appeared on the screen. Where's the camera on this tablet? Okay, it's in the corner. Oh, it's too washed out to see. No, it's disappeared now, anyway. Oh, I'm still recording. Pause you. Okay, this will not stop recording. I think the software's crashed. Well, that's Samsung for you. Trying to put the other battery in. Doing this one-handed. 
because I cannot pause this stupid tablet that's recording. How good is the other battery on here? Oh, that one appears to be fully charged. We've got six hours on the memory card, yeah. It's also got a memory card in there. So thanks for that, too. It's even got level meters. I can see level meters when I'm... Oh, where is the stupid... Yeah. Well, um, yeah, I'm going to take this for a spin. Now, will you come off record? Okay, are we recording? Yes, we are recording. Is my tablet still recording? Yes, it's still recording. Would you believe it? I just have to turn it off. Hopefully it'll stop. Could have used one of my other cameras to record this, but the thing is, well, this one, the battery on that is toast, and this one, well, although it does do a good picture quality, it doesn't do very well with handheld. So, we're making a recording with the new camera. Now, what I want to do is figure out how to charge this up. I'm sure it's not too complicated. Um, there is a USB-C socket there, so uh, maybe we can charge it that way? Let's see. Oh, hang on. Recording with the GoPro now. Right, so I've got it plugged into uh, uh, the charger for this tablet. Seems to be working. I accidentally pressed the record button, thinking I was pressing the power button. And my fan looks like it's going very slowly due to the frame rates, but yeah. I cannot wait to see what the video quality from these two is like. So we got, yeah, I'm really happy with this camera. I don't really know what this thumb wheel is for, and mum's interrupting. This has even got GPS on it. Not that I think I'm going to need that, but it's there. Let's see what we got on the other. Microphone input. Oh, wow, yes it is. We've even got external microphone input. Oh, that's going to come in really handy. Well, um, yeah, I'm going to just review these videos. Can you believe this? We're almost in November, and I still have to have the windows open. I don't know if you can see my thermostat. I can't even see it, because I think this is in the way. Well, this is 24.1 at the moment in this room. Don't know what the weather currently is outside. Let me check the com compter. Yeah, this is why I don't like sunny weather. I mean, look how hard it makes it to see the screen. Okay, about 18. Now, just for the heck of it, I'm recording in 4K with the GoPro, just strolling about the house. Of course, I'm not going to upload any 4K videos to YouTube, but I have the... Oh, look, there's me. Capable to do this. You better not look in my room. And you've already seen the state of that, so I guess it doesn't really matter. So, my forced... Forced? First 4K video ever... Although you're only going to see that in 1080p, but yeah. Oh, 
Although you're only going to see that in 1080p, but yeah. Well, here we are in what I call my shed. I'm not going to talk too loud because there's someone outside who might think I'm absolutely nuts talking to myself. Anyway, in one of my junk boxes, I found one of these. So I might be able to modify that for, you know, UK voltage. I've checked all the, the um, I've checked all three, I've checked all three charges and they can be run on 240 volts. So I might be able to plug them into that or uh, maybe plug them into this weird thing. Have seen, ever seen one of those plugs with the weird angled prongs? I think that's an Australian plug, but I'm not sure. Anyway, let's lock up the shed and go out. Okay, I think I'll start recording from here. Hope I'm not covering the microphone with my thumb. Hope the wind's not getting into the microphone. The weather forecast said it was going to be cloudy today. Does that look cloudy to you? That's just partly cloudy. Well, what should I talk about on an Out and About with Clem video? I really don't know what to say. Oh, I know one thing I should say. Thank you so, so much for the cameras. You know who you are. I forget your name, but... Well, uh, let's see if there's anything good Out and About. I wish I could go out on my bike right now, but the battery's nuked, so... Yeah. Got another one coming. This time the proper voltage, hopefully. Nice posh battery as well. This is what I hear. Every time when I'm out. Are you gonna hear that police car? If I stop walking. Another high speed chase on the main road. You think with the police being out so much, they'd have caught all the criminals by now? Yep, I'm just waiting for my new battery to get here. Sure, it's taking its time, but it has been shipped. Just waiting for it to arrive. Oh, they're getting all their Halloween stuff out. Don't really care for Halloween. Look all the creepy stuff, but Halloween itself, it's just... Just don't really care for it too much. Can certainly tell Autumn's here. Or fall, as some people say. The trees are doing their job. Covering the ground with their leaves. There are some really beautiful colours, but... Don't really like it when the trees lose their leaves and they're all bare. Looks really nice around this time of year, but you know, when the winter comes around and the, all the leaves are gone, looks like everything's just dead. See, kids have been out chalking the side um, pavement. That's not so bad. We could use a bit of colour about the place anyway. It's strange how that camp, um, bike battery went. A couple of weeks ago it was absolutely fine, it showed no signs of degrading or anything. Next time I go to charge it up, it only takes about a third of the time it normally takes. And I get virtually no power out of it. And I've tried charging that up several times, thinking maybe that last one was just a fluke, but no. Yeah, well, like I said, I'm getting a new battery. 48 volts. 30 amp hours. Don't know how much range I'm going to get logging my tremendous bulk around, but yeah. I think the walks are going to do me good, though. Help me get back in shape. 
a lot of people say I'm fat. I didn't really even realise it, you know. I just thought they were just joking with me until I one day looked in the mirror. I thought to myself, who's that fat bastard looking back at me? And I realised it's me. I'm that fat bastard. So, yeah. If I walk across this bridge, it'll probably bend under my weight. Or maybe not. I think with all the rain we've had lately, we this would be absolutely flowing with water and it's just damp. I just cannot wait until I have it. I know I keep going on about it, but... Um, just don't know when it's going to get here. Definitely be able to go a lot faster with that battery. Even though the 36 volt battery I had, I could go scarily fast with just that. I don't actually intend to go, like, zooming along at 30 miles an hour or so. So if I limit my speed to, like, maybe 15 or so, you know, that'll save the battery life as well. Well, I'm almost home now. Can't believe that somebody's doing DIY. But yeah, I'm definitely using this for the Cool Dude Comes Electronic Workshop videos, although they'll be at 24 frames a second because I don't really think we need anything more than that for those kind of videos. I'm going to be using the GoPro for the out and about with Clem stuff. I think I will do those at um, 4K. that way. Here's me talking to myself. He'll think I'm talking to myself instead of talking into the camera. Yep, anyway, I think I've waffled on enough now, so yeah, I'm gonna go. And until next time, goodbye.